All right, if you're making videos here on YouTube, let's make sure you're making money from those videos. Because whether you have a business or not, you can actually get a check from YouTube. In fact, in just the past year, in 2019, YouTube has paid me $2,500 just for making YouTube videos. And that is not my primary source of income. That's just kind of an added bonus. So let me show you today how you can make a couple extra thousand dollars here on YouTube. Hey there, welcome back. My name is Trina, if you are new here, and this channel is all about giving you the confidence that you need to show up on YouTube. Now, if you're planning to start a YouTube channel in the near future, or in 2020, you're gonna to wanna to hit subscribe to this channel because I'm giving you all the information you need to get started here on YouTube from scratch and see results, whether that's more views, more subscribers, or more leads to your business. Now, let's get started with everything you need to do to get your YouTube channel set up so you can start getting a check from YouTube. Yes, actual money that YouTube will pay you. For you to get monetized by YouTube, you have to first have 1,000 YouTube subscribers and have acquired over 4 thousand hours of watch time on your channel. And that does not include private or unlisted videos, that includes your public videos. And you will have to achieve 4,000 hours of watch time within the last 365 days. So this doesn't include the lifetime of your channel, you have to get those 4,000 hours of watch time in the 365 day time frame. Now I know it can be difficult and hard to reach these requirements, but if you're ready to hear how you can hit those numbers faster, make sure you go ahead and hit the like button because I'm about to walk you through how. So the first thing that you're going to need to do is be proactive. And what I mean by proactive is just get your channel prepared and ready for monetization. So let me show you how you can do that. You can actually go into your YouTube channel settings and get everything already set up behind the scenes, even if you don't have those 1,000 subscribers or 4,000 hours of watch time. By getting that set up, that's gonna help you save some time so when you do hit those numbers very soon, I hope, everything's already gonna be done for you and ready to go. So what you're gonna do there is set up an AdSense account. You can set this up without having those requirements done. And so once it's set up, YouTube will have a quicker way to get to your money. What you're gonna do is you're gonna go into the back end of YouTube and go to your settings and go ahead ahead and go through the process for monetizing. Once you go ahead and apply for an AdSense account, you're going to need a home address and also an email account. Then Google's actually going to send you a verification code that you will have to then plug into your AdSense account just to verify you're a human. We all know there is so many spam accounts on YouTube and people try to scam the system. This is just Google's way of proving you are you and you're a human. So once you have that code, you're going to log into your Google AdSense account. You're going to connect your bank account. Then Google's going to put some money into your bank account, like just a couple cents to make sure it goes through. You're going to then tell Google how much much money they put in, then that money will be removed as just to make sure your bank account and that connection is working. So when you do make the big bucks from YouTube, they know that they are sending it to the right bank account. Okay, now once you have this all set up and ready to go, then the hard part starts. One thing that you do need to understand is you aren't going to be able to control your AdSense check every single month. So what I mean by that is you're not going to be able to control how much you're getting paid. And it's not going to be a whole lot unless your channel all of a sudden skyrockets and you're getting millions of views every single month. Basically, you're not going to be able to live off of your AdSense paycheck that you get from YouTube every single month. That's why it's so important. I always recommending having some type of business model off of YouTube. So whether you're selling courses, PDFs, templates, photos, actually list seven different products that you could sell digitally to really help you make that extra money every single month instead of relying on YouTube AdSense. I'll link it right up here so you can watch that after this video to make sure you can start making money here on YouTube without even having a thousand subscribers. Like I said, YouTube is just one of my income streams. I have multiple other income streams from one-on-one -on -one services, coaching, courses, group coaching programs, but YouTube is kind of just that extra money that I get by providing you content to help you grow a YouTube channel and kind of get you recognized and acquainted with me so that you could potentially buy one of those products or services that I do offer. If you actually wanna see all the income streams that I have and how I make $10,000 a month, I'll link that video down in the description box as well so you can check that one out too so you can see exactly how my income breaks down each month and how it's all coming 
coming in because that's really important to understand. You can get started on YouTube tomorrow with zero subscribers and make money. You just have to have these different streams of income coming into your bank account. Now, if you're ready to get that money from YouTube and hit those requirements, here's the work that you gotta put in to do it. You have to get consistent here on YouTube. You have to put videos here on YouTube for you to get subscribers and also for you to start accumulating that 4,000 hours of watch time. Now, I suggest getting started with one video a week when I'm speaking to business owners because they already have that business model off of YouTube and they're using these videos to kind of funnel people over to that. But if you're wanting to get monetized on YouTube ASAP, I would try to create as many videos as possible per week here on YouTube. Two to three videos a week will not only help you get those more watch time hours, but could potentially get you in front of more subscribers. And one of those videos could maybe go viral to really help you get to that 1000 subscriber mark a lot faster. The second thing you can do to get to those numbers a lot faster, uh, because the watch time number is the hardest to get to. The subscriber count can come, but the watch time hours is pretty difficult. So what you can do is create longer videos. So let's say you're generally creating five minute videos and on average people watch half of it. That's two and a half minutes times however many views you get. Now, if you created a 10 minute video, and again, it's gotta be valuable videos that people are gonna watch. If you create a 10 minute video and people are watching half of it, that's five minutes per video, per viewer. So if you're wanting to get to that watch time, hour requirement faster, start creating longer videos, but don't just fill it up with fluff content. Really follow the formula that I talked to you about in this script template video that I did. I'll link it in the description box as well. You just need to make sure people are watching it because even if you create a 10 minute video that isn't any good and people only watch a minute of it, it's still not going to get you to that watch time hour requirement. So if you're going to create those longer videos, make sure it's super value packed and you're really delivering good content to your audience. To get to that subscriber count, you're gonna wanna ask people to subscribe to you. I know it can seem like, well, wouldn't they subscribe to me if they like me? Well, they could, but by you giving a strong call to action in all of your videos to tell them to subscribe, you could potentially see an increase in subscribers. For example, if you're enjoying these types of videos and you wanna learn more about how to make more money on YouTube, make sure you subscribe to my YouTube channel. So you could do it as easy as that, but you need to let people know what it is you want them to do because we can't really read your mind. And here's the most important way to reach those numbers is to get people to binge watch your channel just like Netflix and Hulu. Because you need people to watch video after video after video, accumulating all that watch time for your channel. Also, if they're watching more and more videos from you, they're gonna be way more likely to subscribe from you because if they're gonna watch multiple videos, they're probably liking your style and they're gonna wanna come back for more. So here are a few ways that you can start creating binge sessions on your channel. So once you start posting some videos, you want to look at your analytics. This is very critical piece, okay? You want to see what people are watching your channel for. So you're going to go into your analytics, you're going to look at traffic sources, you're going to go to YouTube search and see what keywords are driving you traffic. So for example, for me, it was first video ideas, YouTube channel ideas. Now, if I wanted to go all in with my strategy, I would just create videos around that particular topic. So first video ideas for photographers, first video ideas for coaches, first video ideas for fitness experts, those types of videos because that's what YouTube's picking me up as. So YouTube's recommending me for those topics. I love studying my audience retention graphs for each of my videos because this graph is telling me how I can get people to watch longer, what I'm doing that people are leaving, and more importantly, how I can get them to the end of the video so that they click on an end screen to watch more videos of mine, meaning more watch time on my channel. You can also look at your videos by average view duration. If you go into your analytics and you look at all of your videos and see which ones are getting the longest average view duration, create more videos around that topic because people are watching it. You can also take the audience retention graphs of those videos to learn even more about how to make those videos better and really up the accumulation of your watch time on your channel. Now you heard me talk about getting people to the end of my video to click on the end screen. This is a critical step if you wanna accumulate watch time on your channel and get YouTube to put your content in front of more people. Remember YouTube wants people to binge watch videos and if you're getting people from video to video to video, YouTube's gonna do all the promoting for you and get you in front of more people. So when you are planning your videos, always have in mind, whether it's in your script, your outline, which video you're going to recommend next. Think about the viewer who's watching the video you're going to film, what 
ideally or what in their journey would they want to watch next. Then at the end of your video, before you signal that the video is over, make sure you tell them why they should go watch that next video on their screen. And then when you upload your video, you can add those end screens to increase more watch time on your channel. Another thing that you can do to binge watch is to create playlists. Whether this is a series of videos, maybe you're doing like a five week boot camp series on how to revamp your Instagram or a five week series on how to make your website better with copy. You just wanna be able to create playlists, three to five videos that people are gonna to wanna to watch one after another, creating that Netflix style binge watching. And bonus points, those playlists can show up in search. So ideally, somebody could find your playlist in search and end up watching three to five of your videos, again, accumulating that watch time and probably gaining a new subscriber. Do you think it's gonna be a little bit easier now for you to hit that 1,000 subscriber requirement and 4,000 hours of watch time to get monetized here on YouTube? If so, let me know in the comments by saying, I'm gonna get paid. And make sure you hit the like button if you want to see more videos on how you can make more money here on YouTube. And don't go yet because I have a video that's perfect for you that's going to walk you through step-by-step step how you can get that 1,000 subscribers. So click the video that's on your screen right now and I'll see you over there to help you get 1,000 subscribers.